say that shit, that shit. Like bad kids, bitch, we reckless. Yeah. Well, hearts are like taxes. Right. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Guapi Joy signing back with another video. And hold up, bro. Um, before we get into this, it is currently 6:15. Um, like all day yesterday and all day today, I've been working on this 4,000 word fan fiction chapter for the Loud House, bro. Like, yes, your boy is really out here like that. Like, who made me like that? I really don't know. But I enjoy doing it, so you can't judge me. Now. Uh, I was originally supposed to do this yesterday, but my attention span is just so out of line and so out, not what it used to be before that I get so lazy that I'm just like, I could do this now, but I'd rather do this later. Now, um, okay, now, what, now today we're here to react to the Honest Trailers. Now, hold on, who is this hitting on my phone? On Twitter. Um, but uh, we're here to watch the honest trailer for the Lion King. Now, if you have never watched the Lion King before, something's wrong with you. Someone did not make you the way that they you were supposed to be made. Like we, me, I grew up on the Lion King. I watched Lion King one, two, and three. I watched all of them at least thirty times each. Like no joke. Like the Lion King. One is really the one that I watch the most because you cannot beat the original. You can't. The second one was I. Right. I mean, it was okay. He had a kid and whatever, raised his own kid. But like, th let's face it, the the first one will never be, will always hands down be the best Lion King that they ever made. Even if they made who? Why you keep my phone? Why why you keep hitting my phone? Like I'm doing a video. But anyways, the Lion King will hands down be the. The best Lion King they ever made. Even if they redid and remade another Lion King today, um, like an up-to-date version, I guarantee you it won't be better than the old one. Guaranteed. But um, but here we're here to watch the honest trailers for this man. Like I heard uh this channel like what is this channel's name? Uh, Screen Junkies. Like they have a long history because I seen their videos before. I didn't see Lion King, but I saw their honest trailer for like um. I think it was like Batman um, Arkham Knight or something, um, one of the Batman games, and uh, for Grand Theft Auto 5. So, um, we're going to watch this. Um, for all y'all, I don't really edit none of my reactions. Like, we just watch it together. Whatever happens, happens. So, without, so without any further waiting, let's get into this reaction. Before there was Frozen, relive the peak oh, God, of God, Disney God. animation, followed immediately by its downfall. The Lion King. <laughs> Revisit the original tale of a royal heir whose parents die, prompting uh -huh. them to run away from their kingdom, then sing a song about letting go of their worries, while things fall apart back home, and return to defeat an evil prince. I knew there was a reason I liked that movie. Journey to Pride Rock, an animal kingdom with some incredibly generous borders. Everything the light touches is our kingdom. And its own version of New Jersey. What about that shadowy place? You must never go there, Simba. We're all... <laughs> Did he just say New Jersey? Bro, I'm surprised he didn't say the south side of Chicago because, this, to me, the my border is between the borderline of of the south side and everything else. The south side of Chicago is something I would never go to. You will literally have to come to me. If you're on the south side and you ask me to come out there to like see you or whatever, you're going to have to come to me or meet halfway. There's no way I'm going to the south side because that's a, that's a war zone over there. It's a straight up war zone. But uh, just be glad that they didn't say Detroit or something because Detroit is all kinds of bad. All of its African animals talk like they're British. Good morning, sire. Evil British. It's to die for. Latino. Que pasa? Jewish mobs. So, where you from? Gangster. There ain't no way I'm going in there. Or CNN. I ain't noticed all this before. Witness the birth of Lion King Simba, an obnoxious know-it-all who rubs his privilege in everyone's face. <laughs> No, bro, no! I'm so down with these niggas, bro. Like, bro, like, low-key, I never noticed that when I was little. Bro, I mean, think about it, think about it. Like, 
Simba, like, he, of course, like, you know he's going to be king one day because he's the son of the king, right? So, and he runs around in everybody's face like, I'm going to be the king one day, and you ain't shit. Like, <laughs> that's the kind of mentality he had during the first be half of the movie. Like, uh, when he was a child before he grew up. Like, after his dad died or whatever. Like, I never noticed that. These these guys, I believe these guys are about to ruin my childhood. I, I believe they're about to intentionally ruin my childhood. Dad just showed me the whole kingdom. And I'm gonna rule it all. <laughs> Watch as Simba's life of leisure is shattered by his evil uncle. A lion who was either named Scar by coincidence, or he got stuck with a really mean nickname. Get ready for a G-rated movie filled with domestic abuse. I'm <laughs> oh, oh, oh my God, bro! <laughs> oh, oh my God, bro, bro. <laughs> um, oh, um. Um, we over here in the department of Guapi Trey do not support domestic abuse. Like, as long as it's not me. You can do that all day long, but as long as it's not me. As long as it's not me. I don't, dem I don't, uh, like, support domestic abuse at all. But, bro, like, Scar legit pimp slap, pimp slap, um, what was her name? I forgot her name, but she was, um, Mufasa's, uh, wife or something. Like, I, I legit forgot he did that. Child raised by a same-sex couple. Not that there's a problem with that. And the most dramatic hey, death now. of a parent since Bambi's mom got shot in the face. Aww. We gotta go home. <laughs> Hakuna Matata? Oh, you really so think you got jokes, huh? go and experience the best music of any Disney musical ever with unforgettable songs like the Be Careful What You Wish For song. Oh, I The plotting evil stuff song. So prepare because I am the bad guy. Be prepared for me to do bad guy things. The catchy song to distract kids from the horrific death they just saw. I went through trauma <laughs> at a very young age. Don't be a downer, kid. They just killed my dad. Forget all that. An African catchphrase. The Billy slow nigga. jam. We are gonna pour tonight. Yeah, we are totally gonna pour. It was nice to be childhood friends of ya. But now it's time to pour. Nigga! Nigga! Oh my god, bro! Bro, where did they do this? Like legit, man. Bro, she's giving me the I, I want you to fuck me eyes. Bro, I just realized that. I just realized that, bro. When I was little, I never knew what the fuck that meant. I never knew what they meant. I just thought, okay, well, they rolling down a hill. And I think she got something in her eye. And she's, and she's looking at me, I got something in her eye. But really, looking back at it now, when I was watching it like a year or two ago, I noticed why she was looking that way. Bro! Like, Disney, they didn't beat around the bush back then. This was back before all that censorship came in, came into play. They really, cartoons back then, they didn't beat around the bush in any kind of way. Like, they just went straight at it. They just went straight to the point. Like, bro, I did not notice that before. And the song that fools us into thinking these animals live in harmony. Now, I don't know uh, what our words really are. Okay. I didn't know what they were saying either. No one knows what we are saying, but it's fun to sing it anyway. No one knows at all. Starring 
Lion Jafar. Lion Jafar. Sebastian, Ren and Stimpy. God damn it, dude. And Eddie. Bro, these niggas, they think they got jokes, bro. Like, did he just say a bird Sebastian? Now, Ren and Stimpy. Okay, now I honestly see how they can resemble them too. I can honestly see. But Ed, Ed and Eddie, come on, bro. Y'all can't be doing all that. Just because it's a trio of two of three dumb niggas, like, that doesn't mean that they're Ed, Ed, and Eddie, bro. Eddie, Doomy Eyes, Dad Vader, and Kimba the White Lion. Seriously, look it up. The Lion King. Wait, if Mufasa and Scar are the only male lions in the pride, then Nala's dad is probably... Oh, no. Oh, whoa! That's him! No, fuck! No! Wait, hold up! They sister and brother? No! Bro, no! There has to be an explanation. No! Hold on. Uh, is there anything else? No, bro! No! Bro! When? No, there has to be some other explanation. I fail to believe the incest that's going on here. No, no way. No way. Because Simba and Nala, they can't be brothers and sisters. They can't. Because, like, unless, wait a minute. Unless, okay, now, Nala, she does have a mother. She does have a mother. Um, Simba does have a father and dad. Now, I don't remember who was the father of Nala, though. I don't. Bro, I don't. I can I, I fail to believe it. I fail to believe it. I'm gonna have to Google this afterwards. I'm gonna have to Google it afterwards because if he does bring up a valid point, because Mufasa and Scar are the only males in the pride. Um, what was her name? Um, I'm just gonna call her like female one. Um, Simba's father. I mean Simba's mother. Uh, she was. She's the first female, and then the other one was Nala's mother. And Scar, maybe, maybe he, maybe Scar was, no, 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 because Scar was Mufasa's brother. That is going to open up, a, I, I got some questions for days. But, bro, let me know what you guys think about this down below. Because right now, I am, I am mind boggled. Right now, my childhood, everything I knew as a child is a lie. Everything I knew was a lie. A straight up lie to my face. To my face. Like, what, Disney? Why do you, you said you wouldn't do this to us? God damn it. Like, bro. I'm done with this shit. I may watch Lion King. I, I was still watching either way, though. I ain't gonna lie. Um, but let me know what you guys think about this down below, man. Now, let me know. Did you guys watch this before? Because I know I'm a little... I, I know... I think I'm like a year or two late on this. But I'm now just finding it. So, um... Let me know what you guys think about this down below. Um, do y'all think Nala... Uh, uh, Nala and Simba are brothers and sisters? Let me know what y'all think. But, anyways, it's your boy, Guapi Troy, signing back out with another video. Um, make sure you like and subscribe if you're new. And until my next video, which is about to be in a few minutes, I'm out.